So the rumors were true. Erdwin's lantern descends towards Galopolis. <sighs> and they say it began when Yggdrasil fell and darkness covered the land. But why? What is happening to our world? Erdwin's lantern, eh? Back in Dundrasil, we had a legend that after Erdwin defeated the Dark One, he ascended to the skies as a star, so he could watch over Erdria for all eternity. That was one of Eleanor's favorite stories. And I always thought it was just that, a story. But now I'm not so sure. I mean, if the Lord of Shadows' rise caused Erdwin's lantern to descend... Are you even listening, laddie? Oh, <laughs> charming. Well, I can share my musings with you again if you'd like. Heard everything you needed to hear, did you? All right then. Well, I suppose this is no time to be standing around pontificating. The lantern's on course to crash straight into this fair kingdom. We'd best go and see what the Sultan thinks of all this, eh? Let's have a nice wee chat, shall we? Hmm. Yes? I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but... Ah. My boy, please! Your reckless heroics will get you killed! Fear not, father! I will take all necessary precautions! By the time I return, the mystery of the star will be solved and Galopolis will be saved! Hmm? Ah, it is you! Thank you once again for all you did for my son. I... What in the name of the... Surely this cannot be! It's been a while, eh, your majesty? Years, in fact. I haven't seen you since the colloquy of kings and the disaster that followed. Lord Robert, please, you must listen. What we were told about the luminary was false. He is not the spawn of the darkness after all. Alas, we were all deceived by King Carnelian. We allowed the world to be destroyed. We brought this disaster upon ourselves. Oh, come on, your majesty. We can hardly be blamed. This is Mordigan's doing. He's the one who possessed King Carnelian and caused all this chaos. This is down to him and no one else. Lord Robert. Now, listen. We need to talk about that star. If Erdwin's lantern falls much further, Galopolis is done for. What do you know about it? Sadly, very little. I have tasked my finest scholars with investigating its origins, but they have discovered nothing. Uh, 
There is one thing that may be of interest. My son Faris claims to have been able to make out runes on the surface of the barrier that surrounds the star. Runes, eh? This is the first I've heard of a barrier surrounding the lantern, let alone anything being written on it. Was your lad sure of this? He certainly appeared to be. In fact, he has taken one of our most learned scholars to the Celestial Sands in order to investigate the runes more closely. It is there that we believe the star will make its landing. I see. Reckon we'd better go and take a good look at these runes ourselves, eh? Shall we head out after the Prince? It would put my mind at ease if you would, Lord Robert. I cannot help but worry about him being abroad in such dangerous circumstances. Ah. Hmm. You have my thanks. I will instruct the guards to permit you passage through the checkpoint. Journey safely. <laughs> <laughs>